everybody, Johnny here. Just wanted to give you a quick update about what's going on at Trillium Domes. I got my janky green screen behind me. Um, been working pretty hard in the office uh, and I haven't been building much, haven't been posting much to YouTube, um, but I've been making a lot of plans and working on a lot of projects that are upcoming. So at the beginning of the new year, I had a job fall through, things like that happen. So um, I've basically taken this opportunity to work on the back end of the business a lot because I have a lot of projects in the works. And as soon as the building season rolls around, I want to be building nonstop. I don't want to stop and have to worry about websites and blah, blah, blah. Summer, spring, like coming up is about to be all about building. So I'm really excited. I'm going to get a lot more detailed in, uh, in the shop. For you guys um i don't want to hide anything i want to show my whole build process and i want y'all to be able to do it so the last video i did was about the circular deck plans um today i actually just put out uh plans for a vaulted doorway that can also be a tunnel to connect two domes together so that basically opens up the possibility for a ton of different dome configurations. You can build one dome and then plan to build off of it later. Um, these are for the three frequency domes. I've also come out with uh, a couple of new plans. I came out with a 40 foot diameter dome plan. It's four frequency and it's on a pony wall. So it's basically as simple as you can get for to get that footprint, to get that size meaning it's the least amount of unique triangles. It's the least amount of panels in general. Um, they're oversized panels, so you can put blocking in between. You can put another triangle in between to kind of faux, make it a eight frequency dome. I also came out with a couple of smaller domes that people have been asking for, three frequency. So I came up with a 12 foot eight plan that's on a pony wall because before I had a 10 foot diameter and a 15 foot diameter. So this is something kind of in between. Um, the great thing about this dome is the longest strut is two foot eight inches. So you can use eight or 12 foot long material and basically have no waste, like almost no waste. It's ridiculously efficient, really cheap, extremely strong i mean this dome is a three frequency shrunk down and then put on a pony wall like you could park a car on that thing it's not going anywhere um and that being said you could also use smaller material to do it um and then the other one that i came out with was an 18 foot diameter on a pony wall and that was a custom design for somebody but i ended up really liking it um for the space and then you get the extra height so once again, it's like somewhere between the 15 foot diameter and the 20 foot diameter, but it has extra little height there. It's got two doorway options. So you can have an awning door or you can have an inset door and you can have a little vent window above the door as well as the other vents. So thanks for sticking around. If you have any requests, anything you wanna know, any burning questions, um, any plan requests, just let me know. Just send, drop me a line, drop a comment. Um, I really, really appreciate all the support. And I can only tell you, like, we are working on some awesome stuff. We have some big projects in the works right now. So I'm really excited for this coming year and beyond. But um, honestly, y'all support is super appreciated because it has allowed me to be able to work on these dream projects and work on these plans. So yeah, stick around. There's a ton more to come. Thank you so much for your support again and catch you soon.